The new year means saying goodbye to the old and welcoming the new, but for many island residents, it's a time to observe traditions passed down through the generations. For the Kurihara, Yamashita, Okahata, Doi, Ohana, pounding the heck out of glutinous globs is the only way to enter the new year. They're using Grandpa Doi's Usu, the stone mortar, passed down four generations from Kauai, now in Mililani. It's a family tradition. You have to keep it going, you know, for the others, like my daughter and their son-in-law. So you have to keep on doing it so they can experience the whole thing. First, the massage. Steamed mochi rice is ready for pounding. Then the heavy hitters come in ready to flex their holiday muscles. In just a few minutes, with just a few turns, the mochi is properly pummeled and ready for shaping. All the friends come around. Uh, we have a party. We eat and we uh, pound mochi. It's, it's something that's really enjoyable and uh, good for the family. Oh, I know. I know. Yeah. The Ohana has grown over the years, reflecting the diversity of island families. As the original uncles grow older, they pass the art of mochitsuki to a new generation. We're getting older now, and uh, it takes a lot of energy to pound the mochi, so we are trying to recruit the uh, younger group. Mochi is much more than a munchie. Its stickiness symbolizes family togetherness. Its sweetness represents the joy of new beginnings and the laughter of the young, taking up an age-old tradition and making it their own. That was the family of our producer, Lindsay. She yeah. better bring us some. I know. Look they good. Looks like they worked up a sweat today, uh -huh, pounding yeah. that mochi. Mm -hmm. Especially with the warmer temperatures outside yeah. today. I look at our weather graphics. We are going to